Hey, what's up, everybody? How are y'all doing today? Hope you're doing well and having a fantastic Friday. But more importantly, an even better launch day. Black Ops 4 is here. Apparently, the mainstream media thinks we're racing for prestiging. I mean, I really don't think we are because there are some people that got access earlier than others, and we don't really race the entire community. Maybe our friends, but definitely not the world. Hey, if you're racing the community, good for you. Anyways, one of the first things we think about is leveling up for sure. That's what I've been doing. I'm not an insanely highly level yet, but I've only been playing for three and a half hours now, I'd say. Leveling up is one of my first priorities, and here are some tips and methods for doing so quickly. My first tip is simple, and that is figure out what works best for you and run with it. If you're an MX-9 user and people are calling you a tryhard for that, to hell with it. Keep using it. Keep being a tryhard and advance through the levels quickly. The MX-9 helped me level up in the beta, and it's helping me at launch as well. Same with the Rampart 17. Always loved the Scar, and it's still a clutch, clutch weapon for me. And same with the Specialists. For me, I'm really liking Crash and Ajax. I thought I'd be using Ruin a lot more, but surprisingly, Ajax is the ace in my opinion, and Crash is the wild card, if that makes any sense. But still, Crash is healing and Ajax is 9-bang are abilities that are helping me go harder in BO4. The best part about it is it's exclusive to only them. Obviously, the enemies can use these specialists too, but for the game mode I'm going to recommend to you, Specialists are going to be limited to only one use per team. My next tip is going to be the game mode that I'm going to recommend to you, and that is Control. This game mode is going to buttfuck you with XP and is going to tear your hole up and rip it to shreds with XP whether you like it or not. Literally everything you do gets you like 50 points and it's incredible. If you play the objectives and work with your team, Things will go very smoothly and it'll be shitloads of XP for everybody. Now, it does matter how much you die in this game mode. You have lives. But if you stay with your team and you guys fight together, dying shouldn't be too common. Unless you're up against some sweaty, no lives, and in that case, rage quit. But in my opinion, Control will be the new number one game mode of multiplayer, even better than TDM, simply because of the loads of XP giving out, and the somewhat complexity of it. Not being super simple. That's what COD players have been asking for for years, and that's exactly what we got with Control. And my final tip is to complete challenges. If you don't know how to access them, hit Start or Options, scroll over to the right to, you guessed it, Challenges. And they'll be laid out in different categories. My main suggestion for this would be to keep them in mind, but not focus on one in particular and try super hard to complete it. Like, you can't really hunt double kills. That's more of something that happens by coincidence when the enemies are standing in bunches or all together. You can hunt bloodthirsties and be a little more cautious when trying to get them, but I think focus on, focusing on them entirely wouldn't really profit your rank at all. Keeping a few in mind and completing them over time Prevented grapple. Because challenges won't really be the only thing you focus on and won't be completed within 5 hours of starting. So keep them in mind, but don't try super hard Tango to down. one in particular. And that'll wrap this one up for today. Pack right here. I made this one short so I can go give more of my useful time to this game because that's probably what the next few months of my life are going to be. And honestly, it makes me happy thinking about that. Anyways, if you did like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you dropped a like on this video, maybe a comment, and subscribe for more. Black Ops 4 content will be here on the regular, and I'm really looking forward to trying to make a name for myself with this. 